longer. Six months of waiting. The IndyCar season is here. And what better way to start it off than in victory lane, right? The 2017 series champion, Joseph Newgarden, taking the checkered flag this afternoon at St. Pete. Our Dave Calabro has been there all weekend having a little bit of fun. And he has a full recap from today's action at the track, Dave. Hi, everybody. Welcome to St. Petersburg, Florida. Guess what? The IndyCar season off to a fantastic start. That means the march to the Indianapolis 500 is officially on. Take a look at this weather. Sunny skies, 80 degrees, the start of a brand new season. Joseph Newgarden was having so much fun, he almost missed his ride for the parade laps. Everyone in a great mood. Dave, we love your voice. Oh, oh, I love you, you got guys, a great man. voice. I love your hair. I want to win a million. You have pretty hair. Power's got pretty hair. Good after, fellas. And after making fun of me, Joseph went to his office and got to work. Team Penske had it rolling. Joseph led 60 laps with his fiance Ashley watching. Newgarden wins the first race of the year. It's big. It's big to get a win at the beginning of the year. I've been garbage here, to be honest with you. <laughs> Since I ever started in IndyCar, I, I was good here in a junior car. First time I came here, I won a race, and then the last seven years have been horrible. But today we figured it out, and uh, it, we had to work for it. I'm telling you, this was so physical. You train all offseason to be prepared, and 30 laps into the race, I was already shot. So. It was about managing and getting the most out of it, and we, we played a little tire strategy today, and that's what helped us. Here is the fiancé, Ashley, of Joseph Newgarden. First off, congratulations. I got roped in. Yeah, how about this, huh? What do you think? I, I know. She's a bad interview. He's so really He's, she says she's a bad interview. She's a great interview. This is a Disney What would you ask her right now? Um, uh, I, I don't, I don't feel how, the pressure? how did I perform today, honey? Yeah. Did I do okay? Beautiful. <laughs> 10 out of 10, always. Beautiful. She was Beautiful. really calm. I was surprised how calm you are in the pits. Well, when you have a camera staring at you, of course you're going to be calm the whole time. I'm like, right there. <laughs> no, it was good. And the pre-race was pretty special, too. Look at this. Former Colts coach Tony Dungy was the grand marshal. He had a chance to take a ride in that Honda two-seater with Mario Andretti driving. That was pretty unbelievable. I have never done anything like that in my life. Um, you can't believe how close you're coming to the walls and how fast you're going um, through the turns. Pretty incredible. I don't think I've seen that expression on your face since you had a Super Bowl trophy in your hand. No, nothing like that. How about your driver? How was this guy? He's pretty good now. He's pretty good. <laughs> he kept us going and uh, always felt like I was in good hands, but we were we were going at a high rate of speed. Now. Would you come back and do this again? No. <laughs> Once is enough for me. Absolutely love Tony Dungy's reaction. We have a new IndyCar fan. And now the teams are packing up. They head to Texas. They race in Austin in two weeks. For now, I'm Dave Calabro in St. Petersburg, Florida, in tough working conditions. Back to you in the studio.